Hippos are extremely dangerous creatures. They can crush the head of a dangerous lion, have an epic battle with their congener, deal with a rhino and a crocodile, and scare the hell out of people just by looking at them. Let's look at these giants in action. In this episode, I'll show you unusual and frightening hippo moments, which you shouldn't watch alone. Let's go. Lioness Lions are excellent predators that can deal with many animals in Africa, including the hippo. This lioness chose one of these giants as its prey. The queen of the jungle approached the sleeping herbivore and began sniffing it and thinking how to attack it, but its plan failed. The hippo woke up and angrily ran at the lioness. It bit its head and almost crushed the predator's skull. It managed to break free at the very last moment. It suffered a real shock and was unlikely to mess with the hippo anymore. But sometimes lions are lucky. On particularly lucky days, they can defeat a hippo. In this footage, we see a small lion pride looking for prey. There it is. The hippo itself came into their territory. The male didn't like it and ran toward it. At first, it frightened the hippo, and then it pounced on it and instantly knocked it down. In this position, the hippo is vulnerable, so the lion begins to deal with it brutally. But to be fair, it was a very young and small hippo. An adult hippo would definitely stand on its feet and teach a lion a lesson, so this predator was lucky with its prey. And this time they came to the hippo's territory. The rhino had come to its pond. Hippos are territorial animals that hate intruders and uninvited guests. Not surprisingly, the hippo opened its mouth threateningly, hinting to the rhino that it's time to leave, but the rhino doesn't understand the hints. Some time passes, the first hippo comes out on land, and the second hippo joins it. The rhino never learned its lesson, so it has to pay with its life. The hippo attacks the rhino with its fangs and pushes it into the water where it falls. The hippo immediately starts biting the enemy. The video stops, but I think it's clear how it ends. Clash You may have often seen footage from Africa of hippos lying in the same pond, eating grass together and stuff. They may appear to be very friendly, but there are often fierce fights and struggles between them. Here, for example, two hippos from Zambia have a fight with each other. One runs into the water, and the second rushes after it, biting its back powerfully. The first hippo escapes as best as it can, but it's painfully bitten several more times. At the end, it has to dive and escape underwater because the second giant is very determined. Fights between hippos occur not only in nature but also in captivity. Here, two hippos have a clash with each other in the enclosure. The hippo from above looks menacingly at its congener and displays a frightening mouth. It seems that it's about to tear it apart, but it turned out that it was just bullying it. As soon as the second hippo went on the offensive, the aggressor ran away, jumped into the water, and swam very quickly. And here it's even more interesting. From the first seconds, it looks like the action is taking place somewhere on safari, but in fact, the hippos have decided to fight right near the human camp, which makes the situation very dangerous. This clip is revealing. We can see exactly how the hippos fight. They open their mouths and bump into each other. In this case, strength is extremely important. The mouth must be kept open very firmly because if it slips, the hippo's jaw might be hit by the opponent's fang, and the first hippo might be injured seriously. The fangs of these animals are 12 to 20 inches long, but sometimes they can grow up to 24 inches and more. They're very strong and sharp, so they can easily pierce even another hippo. Usually, hippos fight each other over females during the mating season. Apparently, this footage shows a fight exactly over a female. The first round went by without any particularly interesting moments. Second round had more action. The hippo on the right hooked its opponent perfectly with its fangs from below and lifted it up, wounding it. The wounded hippo hit back, but the blow was not so clear and precise, so the victory is for the male on the right. But that's not all. Hippos don't only fight each other, cannibalism is no stranger to them. This is confirmed by the footage taken in South Africa. It shows a hippo sinking its teeth into the carcass of its dead congener. At first, it just bites the hippo, and then begins to gradually bite the meat off of it. It looks strange because hippos are considered herbivorous creatures. However, it's not all so unambiguous. Some scientists say that by such actions, the hippo showed its territorial dominance, rather than showing cannibalism. In any case, it looked creepy and strange. Wild Dog and Impala 
But let's return to other animals, because mostly hippos attack them and not their relatives. Here, the African wild dog was in danger. There was an impala swimming in the pond, and the dog decided to get it in order to bring its pack dinner. It succeeded. It was already swimming to the shore, but according to the cameraman, the hippo dispersed the dogs. The impala remained in the water, and the hippo violently threw it in the air. Soon, the poor creature died. Crocodile and Antelope And here's something more interesting. Once again, we see an antelope, but this time it's standing on some island in the middle of the body of water. You can see that it doesn't know how to get out. It knows that there are crocodiles and hippos nearby, so it doesn't risk jumping into the water, but there are no other options. It has to overcome its fear. The antelope jumps into the water when a crocodile crawls into the isla. The reptile immediately swam after it. Note the speed of the crocodile in the water. It goes as fast as a torpedo or a submarine. A hippo rushes across. It dives in and attacks the crocodile with the antelope in its teeth from underwater, dragging them to the bottom. After a few seconds, the hippo comes back up. I think you understand what happened to the crocodile and the antelope. Crocodiles and hippos in general have a strained relationship. They often have to share the same land, so they don't like each other, but they don't fight each other very often either. But here's a different case. Crocodile somehow ended up in a pond teeming with hippos. Several dozen giants couldn't help but take the opportunity to bully the reptile. They began furiously biting, trampling, and crushing the crocodile. This went on for nearly a minute. Amazingly, the crocodile somehow miraculously managed to escape such a huge army and swim away from the hippos. In the end, it even punched one hippo's jaw. It fought to the end and earned the right to live on. Hippos have fights not only with crocodiles but also with buffaloes, another of Africa's dangerous animals. Here we see just that. There are buffaloes roaming by the river, and a hippo is nearby. It's nervous because there are intruders on its territory. And yet, for now, the hippo is patient. But then one of the buffaloes makes a mistake and decides to get closer to the giant. As soon as the horned one approaches, the hippo immediately opens its huge mouth, stands up in a threatening stance, and starts intimidating the buffalo. When this didn't help, the hippo went on the offensive. It ran at the buffalo and began to push it into the river. Only now the buffalo realized that it couldn't compete with such a giant, so it didn't engage in a deadly battle and ran away with its congeners. It's one thing when hippos attack animals, it's quite another thing when they attack people. And this isn't uncommon. According to statistics, every year hippos kill the most people in Africa among all large animals. The number of victims is about 500. This hippo decided to add points to these statistics and swam after the tourist boat swims closer and closer. It looks like it won't reach, but bang. The hippo hits the boat with its huge head, scaring the tourist to death. At least that was the end of it. Escape. A boat is at least some protection, but what about this footage of the hippo getting out of the enclosure and almost ending up on the pathway for passersby? Just a couple more moves and the giant would be free. It could have finished off dozens of people that day, but a worker stopped him. He slapped the hippo several times and forced it back into the pool. That's a truly heroic act. I wonder what the zoo authorities were thinking when they approved such an enclosure for hippos without fencing. If that hippopotamus did get out, the visitors would have to escape. But how? Hippos run at speeds of up to 19 miles per hour, so it's almost impossible to get away from them. Alternatively, one could hide in a tree. The author of this video experienced the scariest moment of his life when he was fleeing from a huge hippo. It's hard to imagine what he felt in those moments when right below him such a dangerous giant was standing. Mouth I think these tourists on safari were just as scared. They came upon a group of hippos and one of them opened its mouth. Just look at that. From the outside, it looks like the mouth of some alien monster. You bet. Hippos can open their mouths almost 180 degrees. In this case, their mouths open by about three feet. Fortunately, this giant only scared the tourists, but didn't even move in their direction. And here is the open mouth of a hippo compared to a human. It looks epic, and the hippo didn't even open it all the way up. This is how hippos get their teeth cleaned in various zoos. It looks impressive and creepy. It seems that the hippo is about to eat the worker, but the level of trust these two have for each other is beyond belief. So attacks are out of the question. That's all, guys. Would you like to see hippos in person? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching, and see you later.